there, so in this video I'm going to be showing you how to multiply 2x2 two two matrices together. So they're called 2x2 two two matrices because there are two rows and two columns in all of these matrices. So when we're multiplying 2x2 two two matrices together, our answer will also be a 2x2 two two matrix. Alright, now, before I start multiplying these matrices together, I'm just going to draw rows around the first matrix and columns around the next one, okay? And you'll see why in a moment. To find the top left element, so the top left number in our answer matrix, I have to use the top row and the left column. And I'm going to be multiplying adding these numbers together. So to find the top left one, remember we're using the top row and the left column, I multiply these two numbers here together, so 2 multiplied by 0, and then I add and multiply these two together, so 3 multiplied by 6. So I'm doing 2 times 0 plus 3 times 6. Now, for the top right element in our answer, I'm going to use the top row and the right column. So again, I multiply, remember, from left to right and from top to bottom. So I'm doing 2 multiplied by minus 2, and then plus again, 3 multiplied by 3. Okay, so you're doing 2 times minus 2 plus 3 times 3, going from left to right, from top to bottom. Now, for the bottom left element, you can probably guess what we're going to use the bottom row and the left column. And, just like the other ones, we go from left to right and from top to bottom. So I'm doing 4 times 0 plus 1 times 6. And for the last one, I'm going to use the bottom row and the right column to find the bottom right element in the answer. So, 4 multiplied by minus 2 plus, again, 1 multiplied by 3. Okay, so... The better you get at these questions, the quicker you'll become, and you won't necessarily need to write down all of what I've just done here. This is just to help you see the working out, to show you how I'm getting from here to here. So obviously we can't leave it like this, we've got to work it out now. So in the final answer, your 2 times 0 is just 0, and 3 times 6 is 18. So the top answer is 18. For the top right, I've got 2 multiplied by minus 2, which is minus 4, and 3 times 3 is 9, so minus 4 plus 9 is 5. Now for the bottom left, 4 times 0, again, is just 0, and 1 times 6 is 6, so 0 plus 6 is 6. And for the last one, 4 times minus 2 is minus 8, plus 3 gives me minus 5. So there's multiplying matrices. Okay, now for the next example, same as before, I'm going to draw rows around the first one, columns around the second one. Okay, you don't have to do this, but I think it's useful so that when you're multiplying and adding, you don't stray out of that row and start using this one or this column and then starting using this one. It's just as a guideline, but like I said, you don't have to do that, it's just something that might help you when you're multiplying. So. Again, when you multiply 2 by 2 matrices, your answer will be a 2 by 2 matrix. So, I'm going to leave enough room for my working out here. And to find the top left element in our matrix, we use the top row here and the left column here. So you're doing 3 times 5 plus minus 2 times minus 3. For the top right, use the top and the right. So 3 times 6 plus, again, minus 2 times 4. Now for underneath, for the bottom left, use the bottom and the left. 1 times 5 plus 0 times minus 3. And for the last one, the bottom right, 1 times 6 plus 0 times 4. Now, don't forget to actually work it out. We can't leave it like that. So, 3 times 5 is 15. And minus 2 times minus 3 is 6. So, 15 plus 6 gives me 21. For the, this one over here, 3 times 6 is 18. Minus 2 times 4 is minus 8. 
So 18 plus minus 8 is just 10. For the bottom left, 1 times 5 is 5. 0 times minus 3 is just 0, so that one just stays as 5. And for the last one, we've just got 6. Okay, so there's multiplying 2 by 2 matrices. In my next video, I will do some more multiplying matrices, but I will change the order and the shape of the matrices. So we might have 1 by 3 matrices, for example, or 3 by 3 matrices. So, um, yeah, I hope you have a look at that next.